This summer, someone is going to win a new car, and this yep. is not just any old car. This is a fully restored classic car that's a hot rod. It's true. Take a look. Here is Storm Team forecaster Michael Fish. Hey, I'm Michael Fish at Valenti Classics for the Classic Free Ride Garage Giveaway. Some lucky person is going to win a 1969 Valenti Mustang. Wait till you see the... Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. All right, Fish, you got us all hyped up, and then what? <laughs> uh -huh. Nothing. We want to see that new car. Mm -hmm. We are going to a little bit, but I just found out we're going to have the worldwide reveal in just a little later. So you've got right to wait Right here first. on the morning blend. Right here. Right here. First up, here's more with Gene Miller from 620 WTMJ and Steve Valenti with Valenti Classics. Thanks what for being here, guys. Not much. We're you guys have today. seen it, right? This is fun. I saw it at 3 this morning when What'd I got you to think? work. The lights were out. It was still gorgeous. It it's glowed beautiful. even in the darkness of a dark studio. It was calling your name. <laughs> You've seen quite a bit of it, Steve. Yeah, You've we've got to, uh, <laughs> got to spend a few hours with this one, but we're finally now getting in the studio here, getting to step back and, and really enjoy it. And kind of just I've look heard at it's it. beautiful. Yeah. Do we want to, are we telling everything about it or just saying what year? Are we giving the whole model everything? Uh, it's a 1969 Valenti Mustang Resto Mod. Resto Mod. Resto -mod. Mm -hmm. What's special about this car? I'm not, I'm not, I'm not a car enthusiast, so I don't know a lot about cars. Mm -hmm. what's, what's unique about it? Well, what we've done is we've integrated all of today's technology into the classic styling of a muscle car from the late 60s. A muscle so, car. Yeah. Yeah, so you get, you get the I best like of that. both worlds there. Right. What, what's the deal with a restomod? I'm not familiar with that term. Well, you restore. You, there's a combination of restoration and modification, so gotcha. hence restomod. So we've got it's got fuel injection like a modern car. It's got uh, you know modern engineered suspension, upgraded brakes, air conditioning, power window features. I mean, it's a lot of. A lot of modern conveniences that just didn't exist back in the day. To folks my age that remember the 69 Fastback when it was new and street, this is going to look body-wise like the 69 that you remember rolling the streets, you know, cruising the avenue back in the 60s, but everything else on the inside is totally different. Yeah, and you built and it from awesome. scratch. Yeah, you can, if you look at some of the before pictures, I mean, it was literally a shell. It was a very solid, rust-free shell, which is important. But you know, the, the, you needed everything you know done on it. But what's nice is like starting with a clean slate, so we can put all of our creative minds together and come up with something pretty magical. How long did it take? Something like that, a project like this? Uh, we ended up spending a little over fourteen hundred um, hours on it, actually assembling it and you know building it. Fourteen hundred uh, yeah. hours. But there's countless hours at nighttime thinking it and losing sleep over it, and what are we going to do here? <laughs> How can we make it better? How can we make it the best Mustang out there? That sort of stuff. So. Oh wow. So what is it? I mean, you you've done more cars like this. You've you know mm -hmm. done restoration. You've built from scratch. You love classic cars. Yeah. Why is this going to make somebody just so happy? Because it's it's just so unique and it's just an absolutely one of a kind. You know, worldwide. You know, thing on a worldwide level would do well. I mean, it's going to win top you know top awards at some major events. And because it's customized, you're not going to go to another show and see one just like it. You know, it's very unique that way. Did you custom blend the color, or is this a color that's taken from the past? Uh, there, there is a production car. It's extremely limited, but there is a production car out there that does have this color. And we worked with um, Single Source, which is a PPG supplier, and they uh, they helped us out with this paint a lot, and it's it's pretty spectacular. What color is this? It's. Uh, are we supposed to tell no. it yet? No. Oh, 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 oh. No, you gotta wait to see it. It's hook me in. Let me go. Let me go to you, Gene, about this, this question. <laughs> <laughs> we can't wait to see it. Um, this. Uh, what? So, um, as um, yeah, what is it? Caesar Milan would say, um, people can go to these events, um, meet you and other people from 620 WTMJ. These events are kind of an opportunity for people to see the car in person, to enter to win. You've done these before in the past. What's the kind of the atmosphere, the feeling? Well, it's just great. You know, first of all, a free car. Who doesn't like that concept? But, right. You know, when you get a, uh, we've worked with the Valentis now for uh, a couple of years, and you know, we had the the Camaro, which was very very nice. We had last year's 61 Thunder. Mm -hmm. gorgeous reproduction it was just you know down to every nut and bolt the exact car from 1961 this one is going to be incomparable because there's nothing like it on the road the color combination the interior the way it's tricked out the suspension everything else and people are going to ask questions I won't know any of the answers that's why Steve <laughs> comes along but uh, yeah it's, it's fun to see the gearheads just you know look it over and go back down uh -huh. you know, memory lane to remember under the hood. oh yeah and they'll go <laughs> underneath the chassis and everything and ask all kinds of questions try to stump these guys 
And uh, it's just fascinating. Then other people come up and just go, wow, that's cool. I want to win it. Yeah, it's that right. simple. You oh, know. it's pretty. Free ride. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay, well, we're going to show you under the hood and the whole reveal coming up. But here's where you can sign up. You can see the car. You can meet Gene. All these different things with the classic free ride. This Friday, it's going on from 4.30 to 6.30. Okay, that's super fun. And that's at the Waukesha State Bank um, and the Century. Um, that's at 294 Highway 83 in Delafield. Okay, Michelle Richards yep. is going to be at the first event. Um, John Mercure then is going to be at the second event. Oh, he's going to be at the Sybaris. Well, that's right. See how that works together? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that's on the 10th of May this weekend from 12 and two t until 2. That's at the Sybaris in Maquan, which is located on Wisconsin 57 in Maquan. Again, a chance for you to meet John Mercure. So those are just the first two events, but there are going to be events going on through July where people can have the opportunity to see this car in person. You go to different neighborhoods, so a lot of people have an opportunity to see it and to enter to win. Yeah, we try to hit all of southeastern Wisconsin. Everybody wants to see this car in the flesh, lay hands on it, sit in it, and see what it, it looks and feels like. So we try to get to as many towns as we can. And, uh, yeah, we'll do 20, 30 appearances through the course of the summer until we finally give it away. That's awesome. Can't wait for you to give it away. Again, this Saturday, again, there's the information from 12 until 2. Well, when we come back this morning, we're going to take you into the driver's seat, as we promised, when we reveal for the first time ever the worldwide reveal of the 2014 Classic Free Ride Car. Tiff will be there in Studio D to show you in just a second, so stay tuned. All right, we are back in the 2014 Classic Car. Check out this beauty, the blue dials, the beautiful stitching in leather. It smells new in here. It's a Mustang. Isn't it pretty? I love it. All right, this is, again, the 1969 Valenti Mustang Fastback or Restamod. I want to say it all perfect. We got to take a full look. So let's zoom out and get a shot of this whole car. Is it beautiful or what? Hi, Steve. Hi, how are you? All right, so here we are. This is the reveal. We're looking at the color. Let's start with the color of this blue because this is mm -hmm. something you said that's on a car that may be coming out. Uh, it's already been out. It's a very limited production car um, that they put it on. It's a, called San Marino Blue Polymetallic. And it's just a really, really cool color, you know, just in the lighting here, but out in the sunlight, it's pretty impressive, too. It is gorgeous. If You've got to see this thing in person. I know we had a shot while I was sitting here. I don't know if we can talk about some of these gauges, because you had told me this is something that's all very specific and truly made custom to fit the car. Correct. Yeah, it's uh, Dakota Digital makes these, uh, these gauges, and we were able to select what color gauges we wanted them to be. And, of course, we picked blue to tie in the exterior color. So you kind of get the modern touches there. Uh, some other neat little features we added were the, was the window crank. And originally oh. we cranked these things. Can we see this now, here? We'll move this way for Chad. Come on in here if you can see this old crank here. Yeah, now instead of cranking and all the hard work that is, you just push a button and it goes up. Push oh. It goes down. So you oh don't my have to gosh. Crank anymore. Okay, can we get a little wider shot so you can see the window too? Look at this. That's just with the old crank. Mm -hmm. How cool is that? The stitching. So everything in here is beautiful and new, right? Mm -hmm. Correct. So yeah. none of this all from scratch. Nothing is, um, is there anything beside the body that's old or restored with um, the rest of mod part? The seat frames and then the, the lower dash assembly is the original, the original parts, but then of course, we tweak those a little bit too. All right, I know some of our car classic fans mm -hmm. are going to want to see under the hood. So yep. let's take a look at sure. what you did to this engine. Now, everything here, what did you start with and, and where did it kind of end up? This is all going to be new as well? Yeah, this is all brand new. When we got the car, it was liter literally a shell. There was no engine, there was no transmission in this car. So it was, it was starting fresh. We could kind of pick and choose what options we wanted to put into the car and what, uh, what drive line we wanted it to have. And we, we did keep it all Ford. It does have a, a Ford 302 engine that's been slightly tweaked. It's, got, uh, it's been stroked to 347 cubic inches, and it produces 450 plus horsepower. So it, uh, not only does it look fast, it goes fast too. It goes fast. So how, how fast do you think you can make this thing go? <laughs> well, on a racetrack, uh, I'd say we could probably maybe get in 100 and a half somewhere in really? there. Really? Mm -hmm. How fast have you had it go? Well, I drove it from the parking lot to here. So, <laughs> so on Capitol, you had it about, what, 35? We didn't even get to drive it on Capitol yet. It was just, just your parking lot. That was all. That's beautiful. Yeah. So when people come out, are they able to open up this, look inside, mm -hmm. sit in the car? I don't know if we'll let everybody sit in it, but because it's going to be on display on a trailer. 
but we're going to set it up where we can, you know, lift the hood up. They can see it in, underneath the hood. It's we so can clean. open the doors. They can see how amazing the interior is. And then being up on a trailer, they're going to be able to look underneath it and see all the, you know, the work that's been done under there as well. This grill is pretty cool. Is there anything unique about this? It uh, just looks so cool. It is a it is a stock grill, but then we um, painted it the charcoal metallic to match the, you know, the match the contrast color on the hood and everything. Beautiful. What else would people love about this? Is there anything else they want to see with the tires or because um, this I thought is this is this old? Is this new? That's a reproduction of the the old style that they call the knockoff wheel. Mm -hmm. That spinner originally would have held the wheel in place. Will this turn too? It will, but it, it just holds the center on right there. Okay. So there's actually lug nuts on it like a modern car, but you get the look of the of the old knockoff style, which was very common in race cars and stuff at in the time. Uh, other neat features, as people look around, we took the bumper that would have, was originally mm -hmm. chrome plated, yeah. and we drew it closer to the body and had to modify it for the angles, and then painted it body color to to match the you know match the exterior. And then one of the coolest things I think on the car that that was done originally there would be a drip rail here, and that was completely shaved off, and then there was a, this lip was added to kind of give it a more sleek, custom, streamlined look. All so right. all that was done. Beautiful. All this is you kind of take one last look. I'm going to give you the information for how you can come out and check out the car for yourself. Look underneath, check under the hood, sit in it. Maybe, maybe right. not. We'll see. This Friday, starting 4:30 to 6:30 at Waukesha State Bank and inside the Century, right in Delafield, is the first place. Then Saturday from noon to two at the Sybaris in Mequon is the next place that you can go to sign up to win. Correct. To yeah. check it out, to ask all the questions that you want. Want to know until you win this classic free ride again? The 1969 Valenti Mustang Fastback Restamod is beautiful. We're so excited that you yeah. let us have this yeah, thank you look very much. here first, yeah. Steve. Thank yeah. you so much. Yeah.